What's everybody? My name is Azzy, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play of The Dark Side Detective. This is only a demo, because I got it off the GameJolt website, which I'll leave the website to the actual developer, and the website to where I got it from, from the GameJolt website down below. This game was on GameJolt, like, February last year. So, almost a full year. Unless it was released earlier. I don't know. It popped up in my search, just for random games. Looked really interesting. Look at games that I've wanted to play, so thought I'd give it a try. Why not? Just get right into it. I have no idea what this game is about. Case one, investigate. Jenny go bye bye. Whoa, I almost shot you there, detective. You shouldn't be sneaking around like that. Officer Dooley. Dooley, you saw me drive up. I had my siren on. You waved at me. I guess this place has me spooked out a bit. A little. Whoops. So what happened here? Chief Scully just called me up and told me to get here ASAP. No details. Seven years ago, old seven year seven year old kid Jenny went missing a day a day ago. No sign of her leaving the house. Seems to be the kind of spooky crap I mean. The kind of case you deal with, McQueen. <laughs> Great. Let's get started. After you, detective, you know, whenever whenever standing in this rain starts being fun for you. <laughs> Officer Dooley, why is there a, a hobo dripping all over my carpet? That's Detective McQueen, Mr. Taylor. He's here to investigate. Excuse me. Where were you last night? How come you didn't notice she was missing? I was out. Sounds shady. You got an alibi? Where I was is none of your business, detective. My taxes pay your salary. They also pay for the cell and questioning room I'm going to have Dooley here take you to. Fine. Here. Call this number. They'll vouch for me. You receive matches. This is a matchbook from Busty Bell's Booty Boutique. <laughs> he was at a strip club. Tell me about Jenny. I love it with you, detective. I don't have much dealings with her. I'll leave that to the nanny. She's around here somewhere. Wow, you're a shitty father. Library. A stuffed... Oh. This statue is ugly enough to be worth a lot of cash. It's <laughs> funny. An old oil lantern. Seems to have some oil left, too. You received lantern. Why? Can I hold it? Can I light it? I should probably light this thing, you know, just in case. Cool. Can I hold it? It's a rookie mistake. I wanted to actually just click on the door, but okay, cool. Wait, what's the point of the library? There's something here? Besides the dog statue? It takes a certain type of person to have an oil painting of themselves. Bookshelf. Good collection of books. Shame the death suggests that they've not been looked at in some time. Closet. Box of junk. What's this? It looks like a black light bulb. You received black light bulb. Now all I need is a disco ball and some white clothes, and I've got myself a sexy party. <laughs> <That's> funny. <laughs> Did you follow me into the closet? You may have needed backup. <laughs> I like this. This is cute. daughter's bedroom. This is the mother? Hello, can I ask? My baby, my baby is gone. Can you tell me about Jet? She just disappeared, my baby. Is there any that- You have to find her. <laughs> She's too hysterical to be of any use. I don't have much use for a dozen pairs of pink socks. Everyone's got a thing for socks. Tell me where she is, bear! <laughs> I'm only kidding, you don't know. You're a bear. <laughs> Stupid, no nothing bear. <laughs> it's funny. She seems like a sweet kid. I hope I can find her. Maybe in a minute. 
What's the nanny doing in the master bedroom? Nothing suspicious, that's for sure. No siree. That's something a suspicious person would say. She's, um, she's a good kid. Spoiled and sticks her nose where it doesn't belong. But that's what I'm, well, that's what having super rich parents will do to you, I guess. Suspicious. It's hard to believe this picture and the crying woman are the one and the same. Why, they have the same no face. What's this? Seems like a paranormal contraband. Seems like paranormal contraband. It's a page from Occult for Dummies with some sort of weird pattern on it. Occult for Dummies. She's beautiful. Ask her if she's single, you know, as part of the investigation. <laughs> Can I do that? That? Oh, er, no. I'm more of a complete idiot's guide kind of gal. I probably shouldn't show these to Dooley. <laughs> Jenny and her mom look quite happy in this picture. Suspicious of that nanny. Why did it take so long to load? That's so spooky. I don't really want to go up there. Yet here I am. The paint thinner spilled when the shelf broke. Hmm, may not be broken after all. Just a blown bulb. I hope this doesn't reveal somebody's attic shame. Ooh. Demonic doorway. Just to skip. What the heck? Well, that doesn't look ominous at all. I don't know what you want me to do about this. Do you want me to, like, put this pattern? The pattern on the wall looks washed out in places. I have no way to redraw it. Paint thinner? Seems like a bad idea. Lantern? That's a rookie mistake. A cult pattern and paint thinner? Paint thinner and paint cans? Pff, I don't know. Can I go interrogate people with that information? It got so loud. I saw that goddamn doorway and it got really loud. Why does it take so long to load between that room and that room? It's like no time at all for any other room. That doesn't look ominous at all. What can I do about that? Mm -hmm. I've answered all the questions, I leave me be. Thinner somewhere else. I don't know what to do with the paint thinner. Flowers. <sighs> Places fancy deserve something nicer than plastic flowers. Plastic? It's kind of weird. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do about that. Psst. Mother? Oh, wrong person. Mother. Mother, and I douse her in paint thinner. I don't know what to do. There's nowhere else I can go. This is really spooky. Wow, a schooner. Haha, <laughs> you dummy. It's not a schooner, it's a sailboat. A schooner is a sailboat, Dooley. <laughs> Light it on fire. I don't know what I'm doing. for the noise if it's coming through. There are some idiots on this floor. It's quite lovely. Mm -hmm. 
There. Okay. I did it. No harm detected, but I ain't going into that creep fest. Eh, I'll eh, stand guard out here. Eh. Hey, mister. Hello, kid. Are you here to take me home? I am. Good. I was getting hungry. <laughs> Not so fast, detective. Where's Dooley? The cop? I knocked him out. We can't have you snooping around anymore, so I'm gonna trap you here. Sigh. At least take the girl. Oh, I intend to. I'm her leaf garden, after all. It's my job to look after her. Especially if anything should happen to her parents. Say, for example, getting trapped in a dark mirror world of their bedroom. That's what this is about, an inheritance scheme? Even if you do get rid of me, then what? She knows what you're up to. She's a smart kid. What about Dooley? He'll wake up and know what happened. This is all an inheritance scheme? You have to admit it. No. What was her voice? You have to admit it's a fairly perfect crime. Even if you get rid of me, then what? She knows what you're up to. She's a smart kid. If she's so smart, she'll know to keep her mouth shut. What about Dooley? He'll wake up and know what happened. Hmm, good point. I'll just have to get you to drag him across. I'll just have to get you to drag him across to here with you. Come on. Okay, drag your friend in here. No funny business. One more step and I'll shoot. Now get hauling. I'm scared, mister. I can't go back through. I have to think of something. Those are definitely heavy enough to knock someone out cold. Shame they're out of reach. Insert wood equip here. No! Huzzah! So the kid got in the nanny stuff and accidentally used it to trap herself on the dark side? That's a, that's a surprisingly useful summary of that of things, yes. Shame that nanny was certifiable. She was a looker. Duly, she was dabbling in the dark arts with an aim to lock innocent folk in a parallel world. <laughs> Kidnap their kid and steal all their cash. I said it was a shame, jeez. I wonder where the nanny got the occult book from anyways. This stuff is hard to find these days. A case for another day, Dooley. First of all, I had to figure out what kind of paper paperwork covers this mess. <laughs> that was a really cute little first mission, though, too. I was like... Is that it? Is that, like, the demo? Is that it? Je more. Is that it? There's no like... Okay, well give me a minute. So that was the demo for Dark Side Detective. Cute game. I like it a lot. I like the this whole art style. It's very... There was some game I played like a long time ago that was just like this art style. I can't remember what it was though. I loved it though. Love this too. I also like how it's kind of like detective but dealing with mostly occult stuff. Which is kind of neat. I hope I can actually find the rest of the game, or that there's a way that I can play the rest of the game, because it seems like it's got like a really cool premise. And if those people don't shut up, it's gonna be bad times. <laughs> um, no, so I will just like I said before, I will leave the description in the, in the description both the website for the game developer developer and the game jolt page, because that's where I found it initially, and then I found there was an actual website for it. So, yeah. Then you can try it out for yourself. See if there's anything I missed. I don't know if I missed anything, but see if there's anything I missed. So, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, next video, I'll probably play one another, another kind of game jolt game. Because that's what I'm doing right now, instead of doing scary games. Because I have to slowly work my way back into scary games. So, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye! That's cool.